All right, I just have to make this video. This is my second attempt to teach some people what the difference between uh, kilowatt and kilowatt hour is. So I'm gonna make it really short and simple. Battery capacity is measured in kilowatt hours. Charging power is measured in kilowatt. Energy consumption is measured in watt hour per kilometer or watt hour per mile. Charge energy is measured in kilowatt hours. Consume energy is measured in kilowatt hours. Power output is measured in kilowatt. So, you know, it sounds really simple, right? It took me less than one minute to explain you this, uh, at least list all the correct uh, units. So let's do a little quiz here. Okay, true or false? We have eight questions. Tesla Model S with 85 kilowatt battery. All right, that was first one. Second, the supercharger delivered 118 kilowatt hour of power. Hmm. The supercharger delivered 50 kilowatt hour of energy. Hmm. I install a 22 kilowatt hour Tesla wall box at home. Tesla Model X P90D Lilliquist was measured to 425 kilowatt maximum power. Average energy consumption was 250 watt per kilometer. Okay, I charge for 15 minutes and gain 20 kilowatt hours. Or what about the last one? The total energy consumption for the trip was 180 kilowatt. Yeah, uh, which one is true, which one is false? That's kind of hard, so I guess we can have a quiz you guys try to answer. Why the heck would you care, you know? Kilowatt, kilowatt hour, is so, it's so complex and people understand me anyway if I use the, the wrong term. Well, yes they do most of the time, but sometimes it can lead to confusion. Uh, and uh, just to take, make some more examples here, what would you think if people start saying this like, all right, the distance between A and B is 150 miles per hour. That's totally wrong. Distance is measured in either miles or kilometers or something, you know. And what about, okay, he was caught driving 200 kilometers in a 60 zone. What the heck? Are you not allowed to drive 200 kilometers around around in the 60 zone? Then you're gonna get a ticket. What? What? Shit. Uh, what about, the top speed of the car is limited to 250 kilometers. So what that must be like a Mercedes or something. So you can only drive 250 kilometers and then it's limited. The top speed is limited after 200 km 250 kilometers. I don't want that car. Shit. Okay, uh, they move closer to work and reduce the distance to 20 kilometers per hour. Wow, they did. How, what was the speed before then? The speed must have been much higher before, right? Wait, or oh, distance? Hmm. All right, and the last one is the best. The new Tesla P100D has an amazing range of 613 kilometers per hour. It's freaking sick. That speed, like, goes faster than a bullet train, yeah. <laughs> um, all right, so I hope this was uh, useful for you guys. So uh, that's it for now then.